Hey guys, it's me, a little farfetch and welcome back to Pokemon Gaia, where today I think I might have actually completed a bit of the story off camera, but we've already unlocked the next gym. I just had to fight a few of these biker guys, so... Yeah. Also, we have a new member to the team. Stunky. The dark and poison type. I've always wanted to use one of these as well. He's got the ability Stench, which helps repel wild Pokemon. Good ability for not repels. And the moves, very swipes and night slash, slash, and toxic. I think this gym is actually a water type, so Luxure will be useful today. Got everyone up to level 45, just being cautious. I think you can't even get water here, I bet. And water encounters. And then I went to this weird underground place, got a few items. I don't know what to do now after this. Oh, I think this gym's a poison type. I think it'd actually make more sense for this to be a poison type gym. Yep, it's poison. Let's have Skunk Tank fight our Stunky. Think you can make it so I can't see? If I would have gotten a crit there, that would have been much better. I ain't got a lot of experience, though. You know, since it's not... ...the gym, I thought, let's switch out to Scoobat. I forgot Swoobat exists. Once you obtain true discipline, your body can ignore foul smells. I really don't think sewage is going to be ignored. I ain't psychic. No, that's not good. Wait, I can also do... Uh, I could have done Aerial Ace. That would have worked as much as Psychic Moon. Speaking of that... That's not good. That's not gonna do anything. Cause I'm stronger than it. Although the levels are now catching up to me, and I'm scared. Oh, I can't go that way. Okay, what's back here? Another way I can't go. Okay, we'll get this one out of the way. Since the last trainer, I can come back to it. Now see, this is why I use psychic guns. I'm gonna guess the gym has around level 45-ish. Good for preparing, at least. Good thing I thought about training up to at least 45. You're nearly there. Not really, because there's so much other stuff I have to unlock in this gym before I can get to the final place. So 
so we have our final team member, which is amazing. Okay, we can't go that way, so we're forced to go this way. Yeah, I fought this bike gang, and then I was able to make it to the gym. Sorry, I just woke up. I'm really tired, still kind of from the last episode. It's a Viper. This is Jesse's Pokemon. <clears throat> Isn't this two gyms in a row that Swoobat is the best at? All these biker gang, for some reason, had Mighty in it. I don't know why. They just did. Weeping Battle. See, I also got Fly here, too. They gave me Fly when I fought the Biker Gang, so... After this gym, I think we can fly, so I bet we're going to fly somewhere. To where? I don't know. I think if I press this button, everything should unlock. I think it works. It didn't unlock. I kind of just keep on forcing the music to reset itself. One of those ninjas. I guess it's a bad disguise for a sewer. Yeah, it's a bad disguise overall. Just stop using it. I might want to actually put on fly just for the leg types. Cool fish. Oh, see, that would have worked with electric. I was thinking this gym was a water type for some reason. Because it said something about waves on the sign, so I was like, water gym. So, let's put fly. What's in there? It's up here. On Swoobat. Okay, which one's better to get rid of? <sighs> Goodbye, Aerial Ace. I know I just recently used Aerial Ace, but it looks like we're not using it anymore. Now, did that unlock the gym? Yes, it does. Okay, that guy's just a bat. Or something else. I think it's a bat. I don't know. I don't think I trust Sid. It's down here. Okay, if that brings me out of the gym, let's not do that. So you're the hot shot taking them all into your own hands. I like your style, kid. But you know, crime around these parts doesn't disappear overnight. Just take it for me. To oh, it's an Arbok. Between you and me, my name is actually Sid. It doesn't have any hero ring to it, though. Hence the alias. 
As was best well, it helps when you work in the sewer. Let me show you the real justice feels. Okay, now that looks a lot more like an Arbok. Knowing that it's supposed to be an Arbok. Okay, so good thing I did a little bit of training because their level 40 is his first Pokemon. Okay, I don't want Suvai to get all the experience. So if I can at least make sure that someone else gets experience too, I'm going to. I think Drapan's ground type. It's not a ground type. What typing is Drapan? It's gonna use a yeah, another healing potion. It's a dark type, so Psychic would not have worked on this. This is one of the new Pokemon to Pokemon Go. Pokemon Go is actually what has helped me appreciate the Pokemon uh, skunk tank some more. Which is why when I found out I could, I added it to my team. Of course you have a mega stone, why wouldn't you? Seems weird having another gym right after. This probably would have taken the whole episode if I would have done the bike gang stuff beforehand, but I didn't realize that was part of the story. I didn't realize that I unlocked the gym. I was just sort of using him to train. Endeavor, I don't know that. I need that move. The move just makes it so you switch your HP with the opponents. Heroic display, take this. The pollution badge. Seems my filtration was effective. You're a pure trainer, so take this. Is it Sludge Bomb? Yep. Please say that Skunk Tank can learn that. Not Skunk Tank, uh, Stunky can learn this. Look at all the moves that I have. <gasps> He's able to. We need another move on him. So this is 90 damage, that's good. Fury Swipes, you're gone. Forgot Fury Swipes and. Learn to sludge bomb. Now I guess I have to backtrack. Unless there's something down here. There's not a secret door down there. I have to backtrack. At least it's really easy to just go through this water. What's this guy say? Well, you managed to take sit down. That's impressive. You also seriously stink of the sewers. Well then, thank you. I knew something was gonna happen. Listen, punk, this information is important. Stop fooling around. Oh, fetch perfect timing. Come help me out. 
This mighty Anna dude here, he says he has valuable information about the new elders, but he refuses to talk. Wait, did he say fetch? You're the kid who took down Akuto. Please don't hurt me. I'll tell you everything I know. I hope I heard them new old oldens or whatever talking about Registeel. Says they're headed north to some cave headed to some cave north of the city to awaken it. I think they said it was the Friar Ruins or wait, no. Fier Fair Ruins. Yeah, that was it. Anyways, they was rambling about some new world order stuff. Then some dude in silver, like the big boss, appeared. He said a few things and then they all left in a big hurry. He looked real intimidating, like, if I was you, I wouldn't go chasing after him. And that's all I know, I swear. You didn't hear it from me, though, Capiche? Last thing I need is some big time criminals going after me. I probably said too much as it is. I'm out of here. Whoa, what just happened? You took Akuto down? That's awesome, Fetch, you continue to surprise me. Now, what was that? What was it that guy said? Fair Ruins, right? I saw it on my town map. It's north of here. So we just go through the underground path. I'll meet you there. Then don't take forever, alright? So I can leave the city by going north. By going through these. I don't think I go here. Yeah, basically what I did... I think I found a glitch. I found a glitch. There's not supposed, there's supposed to be a level thing right next to the 26. Unless that's not usually what's there in wild Pokemon, but I think that's just a glitch. Yeah, it's just a glitch. Hey, rum hacks aren't perfect. So where's this underground entrance? Where's these underground entrances? That's special Pokeballs. I guess the leader of the Mighty Inna people was Akuto, and I took him down. And because I took him down in between episodes, because I didn't know it was part of the story, and that let me in the gym. So this episode would probably be over by now if. I would have taken it on during the episode. Oh, do excuse me, child. Wait, we've met before. You're Charles today, right? Say, you're not the same trainer who helped Bell at Sabuto. Oh, you are astounding. Charles has recruited quite the prodigy. I knew those new elders were up to no good. Now, I must dash, but if you're headed past here, you'll need this. <gasps> Finally! I'll come let you scale the rocky walls and tell them work outskirts. It's a pleasure meeting you again. Oh, this is embarrassing. I'm afraid I've forgotten your name. What was it? Ah, Fetch, of course. A wonderful name indeed. Very well. Good luck on your journey, Fetch. Okay, I know I probably cannot use rock climb until we get to the next gym, but... As a precaution, who can learn it? Okay, they changed the TM cut in this to a bug move. Did they change rock climb to a rock move? <sighs> they didn't, and I'm planning to win the Canarnet. What moves does he have that I can switch out? Okay, I'm thinking we're not going to find any whirlpools, so... Clark Climb it is. I forgot what move I was doing for a second. Let's see what Pokemon we can get here. Yeah. This one also still needs to run the Rock Smash. Mighty Anna! 
I know at this point I have a full team, I'm not switching out anyone. But I mean, if I can just encounter a shiny Pokemon, that's a different story. I've evolved all my Pokemon, I'm not an easy trainer to take down. Oh, are you? I've never healed. Just realized that. Never healed my Pokemon after the gym. Okay, I can do that. I'll just stay in with Haryana. Not Haryana, I'll stay in with Suda. I guess technically I'm staying in with Haryana on the screen. See, let me test. Uh, we have a rock climb right here. Oh. Okay. Oh, it's one of these places. This is where I mentioned back in, like, the second episode, I think. TMO1. Last time I had a Clefairy in here. What's TMO1? Magic Shine. These are myths a powerful flash hitting all foes. Guess this room is evolving because it's playing the evolution music. So we can use Rock Climb. I'm from the Kanto region. Let me show you Kanto's finest. Is that really what's going to happen? Are you really going to show me Kanto's finest? Because cause what if I... Sludge Bomb. It's going to do no damage. But it is going to poison. Oh, that's going to do some damage. Stop. Okay, good. Perfect. See, with Emporion, I'm probably never going to use Rock Climb, but see, I got the perfect move for Emporion. Surf is like the perfect move water wave. Like, I don't know if it's the best water move you can get, but I always use Surf whenever I get it. I think he evolves in one level, so I'm gonna get him leveled up this episode. So I like how he says, let me show you Kanto's finest. Two pre-evolved Pokemon. Not fully evolved. And both of them have a weakness on my team. Really showing me Kanto's finest. In fact, both went down in one attack. Let's try out Rock Climb up here. I can't Rock Climb, but I can sure impede anyone else who tries. No, that's not happening. Oh, I expect you to be a rock type. I always thought Zubat was rock type. Okay, so the gym that we just took on was level 40. I don't remember the highest level. I wasn't paying attention to that. I just remember paying attention to the first level when that came out, which was 40. We might want to do some training in between episodes again. And that's we're not going to take on a gym.
move it. No. And you're gone. Yes, I would like to use rock climb. This is actually the way I need to go, I think. Might actually be, I think we'll pick up the items off camera. Nitto Queen. And Empoleon, go. Yes. And since already leveled up Stunky, I'll keep him out. Oh no! Stunky's evolving. Two. Skim tank. Okay, now that we have the ball tail, I'm gonna switch him out. For tripping it. Where's our next town? Because now we have to swim. I have the choice band on Trevenant, so it should do a lot more damage, but it also means I can't use any other attack. I mean, it doesn't matter who you switch out to, I'm going to take you down. Running through the sand is so fun! Not really, because sand can get in your shoes. It's not really fun, man. The noon. Don't really have a move for you, so let's just use Avalug. I think, in total, on this team, we've used... Trident... Hold on, let me see what my team is. I think, in total, I've used three Pokemon that I've never used before in a playthrough. Because I used Swoobat in my first ever black playthrough. 
We're at the place. You swoop at my first ever black playthrough. I always choose Piplup when I do Gen 4 playthroughs. And Luxray, I like Luxray, so I'm gonna choose it as well. Let's knock this trainer out of the way. See if we can get any Pokemon here and then we'll end off the episode. Uh-oh. He's the wrong move. Because now I can't attack. Should have boxed me from switching out. Yep. That would have been painful if I got stuck with Will O Wisp. And then I couldn't switch out. I actually don't know what I would have done at that point. No. Can I get any encounters if you're. Yes, I can. Standard cave encounter. Let's fight this new elder just so I can get him out of the way. Choose the wrong guy to walk past. Boom star. Why is that not doing that much damage? It should raise my attack. Of course you protect. Why wouldn't you? Wasting time. That's all you're doing. Kabu tops. So you're gonna have a good Pokemon to deal with these two. I like how this team likes to use the whole fossil Pokemon and stuff. It's kind of a cool concept. But of course you're gonna live this attack. Why wouldn't you? Player defeated, new elders grunt. Keep walking. Oh, it's water. Let's see what other encounters I can get here and then I'll end up the episode. Just go back so far. It's a new one. Ooh, that's a new one too. Hoonage. Do two more encounters, see if I can't find anything else. Bronze on.
One more. And Gastrodon. I'm heading off this episode here. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.